I don't like how you look. I'm getting you first. I don't like you. I don't like you. You're you're prancing. That means you must do something awful. Get the prancer. He deployed the fighter. Did I hit it? I didn't get one. Stand by. What are you doing? Stop! Launch. What are you doing? Launch. Ah! Ah! Hard, hard to start. We can put Everybody them hard to port, maybe? Hold hard to port! Roger that! <laughs> Moving the sails hard to port! I Captain, should I put them full sail or half? Mr. Bordock, could you please put the sails hard to starboard, sir? Hard to starboard, I, Captain! Thank you, sir! Hard to starboard, which is the other way! Rawr! Okay. Somebody please help me. Wait. How do you. Ah! Hard to starboard, going to dar the bar. All of a sudden, I'm sounding Swedish. Hard to starboard. There we go. Dummy, you just oh my gosh, he got wrecked so hard. I don't know why he died so fast, but I don't care. Cause that was hilarious. Re us. It's like this other language is just like gloss in the white from the tooth not that. And you like You make the Leonardo DiCaprio like like inception face, you like so what you're saying is that we're getting an update in Q4. That's why I need to open and talk to them after that. So, what you're actually saying is that we're going to get a new ship in the second half, in the middle of the year? Okay, I'm excited. <laughs> you know, we don't know. We don't know what they're saying. You know, sea of Thieves is a good uh, alternative game to Elite because it's a similar structure. It's missing a lot of content. Oh boy. It's missing a lot of content. It's a big sandbox. You're in a ship. It has multi crew. That's kind of broken. There's lag. There's only instances of 24 people. Yeah, you should feel you should fit right in. You should fit right in to Sea of Thieves. No! Quake is the most action-packed shooter in the genre today. Revolutionize this and that and that. Um, actually, uh, Unreal Tournament introduced new game modes and all kinds of new weapons and all new types of announcers that Quake can only dream about. Quake is just a rehashment and a tech demo of the... Um, actually, Quake actually did that before Unreal Tournament. Unreal Tournament just took the, uh, they just took the tick to mode and then they added some stuff to it. And they added some bells and whistles. Um, actually, no. Unreal Tournament developer Samuel Adamson was actually part of the Quake team. And he came over and he actually wanted to do it over at Quake. And they wouldn't let him. So he came over to Unreal. Um, actually, they fired that guy for con copyright infringement. You know, that was going on. Sounds like they were trying to pander to all the people who were going to complain. No, what if I can't make the CG? I'm on vacation on Mars. And when I get back, everybody else is going to have the decal. And I'm not going to be able to play because I don't have the decal anymore. And my friends are going to have the decal. And I'm going to be like, oh, man, I paid my money for this game. Why don't I have a decal too? So Frontier, if you're going to make this competition, make sure it's fair. Why don't you just give it to everybody? Why does it have to be a competition? While you're at it, can you give me 10 billion credits? Oh, can, can, can credit me 10 billion credits? And why is there a rebuy system? I don't have to want that. What, I don't what do I have no do we don't even this I don't want to even spend the credits frontier. Am I channeling the inner the entitled gamer here? <laughs> that laugh. <laughs>